So making wings don't have to be an unhealthy thing, guys. You can air fry it or you can do it the way that Joe's going to do it today. So you don't have to always deep fry it, all right? So Joe, are you going to be broiling it? I'm not going to be broiling it. I'm just going to put a little bit of olive oil on it and just mix it up, mix it up. And... In order to broil it. Right. Well, let's start with the new thing that we're going to add to the show, right? We're going to start adding this. The Belizean word of the day. The word of today is hear, like when you hear something, H-E-A-R, mm -hmm. and the, the Creole word for hear is year, year, Y-E-R. My Aunt Grace had a parrot, Joel, mm -hmm. and used to sing this little song like this, on a, on a boy, on a girl, on a yeri wemi yeri, yeri wemi yeri. <laughs> it's like, you boys, you girls, did you hear the gossip of the day? Year, Y-E-R. So let's get into this, Joel, cut it up. And if you guys notice, he cut it on a glass cutting board. I'm having issues at Facebook, Jojo. Go ahead and wash it. Jojo's yeah. gonna take it to the sink to well, wash it with some vinegar and water. Show it, Jada. Say hi to Jada, guys. Hi. <laughs> Say? You're just mad because your parents need you after a bottle of water, Evian. <laughs> What's in your chest? Some kind of lotion. lotion or something? Yeah, so Joe uh, rinsed it off with vinegar and water. Why? Because we're Belizean. If we didn't have the still white vinegar, we would put lemon or lime. We always do some type of acid on the meat because we feel like it kills any bacteria left over from the packaging. We don't know. We don't even know if it's true, but that's what we do, all right? And we kind of give you the side eye if you don't do that. We kind of judge you like, oh, she just took that meat straight. Joe, I remember when I was a little kid, mm -hmm. one of my dad's sister visited from New York, right? Well, mm -hmm. I was like 15. Yeah, anymore. Kain, no, no, we don't have no kain, Joe. So, mm -hmm. she born and raised a Belize, right? Mm -hmm. Tell me why she asked my dad to go buy her this expensive beef steak or something. We don't know what it was, because we can't eat the expensive thing. My dad went to go buy it for her, right? Mm -hmm. And she took the thing, cut the thing out of the, um, you know how it comes with the, like this? The foam? Mm -hmm. Cut the thing out the foam. And she just threw it right there on the stove and started to cook and season it. Mama said, we can't eat that. What? So what wrong with her? She born and raised in Belize. Jesus. She dead now, so I could gossip about her. So anyways, what you got in let here? me move this out of the way. What you got in nothing. Here? It don't cuss on you. <laughs> you don't even got some onion powder or nothing? So what? Onion powder. We, we don't have onion powder. We have nothing. You don't have to make it work, boo. We run out of Let me go check it back for Kaya. I, I, don't, want, I don't need that. I need you. We have cayenne and garlic powder, but no onion powder. There's a fly in here. Another one? Oh, it came from that laundry room. Hold on. So we don't want to go in that laundry room. Cover everything up. We might have to pause to kill it, guys. See over there? It's on the, it's on, it's on the, uh, the, right there. Where? I don't have the thingy. Oh, see ya? Stomp it, stomp it, stomp it. Yes, I killed it. Joe hit it with the fly swatter and I killed it. I swear these flies come in and hatch, and then one day they all, well, they lay their larva or something, and then one day they all hatch. Because I don't know how come so many of them came into there and they weren't in here when for it, days. Uh, when, it opened, when it opened the garage and come through the garage. Okay. And so Joy, Joy was in there getting all that stuff. Today? Yesterday. Yesterday, okay. Salt, la pepper, Ricardo, right? Which is the, um, the anato. Cayenne, we like cayenne. Belizean people don't really cook with cayenne, but we personally like cayenne. Well, put some of that. Yeah. And he was looking for onion powder, and we only put onion powder when we're not cooking onion with the thing, right? Not to put it, but I just like. It. But if we like, if we're cooking stewed chicken and that's gonna have onion on it, we don't put onion powder. Mm -hmm. We don't double put that. So he's just seasoning up real well, and we stopped by the store just now to buy some. Um, is it Frank's Red Hot that you got there? Where's the pepper that you got? Mm -hmm. You put it away already. Yep, some Frank's Red Hot. Mm -hmm. Buffalo. They made this with buffalo? Huh? It's hard for me when we're taping the show and I'm not on that side. I feel like out of whack. Because <laughs> I like to like just go into that little corner. And it's kind of hard for me when we're trying to tape with two cameras and then tape with a third to do real. And by the way guys, my Sony ZV-1 camera is broken. It's in the repair shop right now. It's gonna come to at least $400 to repair. The camera costs $800 brand new. So that's what we kind of looked at for the repair. I'm so depressed today. All right, so he put some olive oil. See, it wasn't a whole lot, right? A little bit more salt because this salt is not really that salty. 
Are we sure? Yeah. Because I feel like he oversalts the food sometimes. I'll no, complain. No, no, I'm going to no. lodge my complaint. No, I know. That's why you use that salt because it has less sodium. Yeah. So you can eat less sodium, but you keep putting more salt. Oh, I'm yeah. putting that you put more sodium. Okay, boss. No. Put them spaced out. It doesn't matter? It doesn't matter. Once they don't touch each other. Once they're not on top of each other. Okay, children. Once they're not on top of each other, he said. We got it? We got it. All right. So then I think we have to put the oven on broil. He's gone. As usual, he abandons me. So go to broil. It has upsetting for broil. All right, so broil. And once it comes up to temp, we're gonna shove this in and we're gonna see how long it takes, all right? Got it? I put it on broil. Okay, cool. You still got something in here? Uh, no, there's nothing inside the oven. Let me see where the rock at. Is it low enough, high enough? I want it Lower? This is better. So he's putting the top rack pretty low, like to the middle of the oven, because he doesn't want it to burn. Because our uh, broil is on the top. Some people broil is on the bottom, right, Joe? In their in their oven? It's on the top. No, some people. Think, Do you think some think so. some stuff have the broil on the bottom? Ours is on the top, so we don't want the stuff to burn. Okay. So it's not like a cake, right? Okay, people. All right, guys. I think we give it maybe once it start to get heat up really. Once it's up to ten. I think it may be like 35 minutes the most. But once it gets up to 10. Right. So when, once it gets up to the 500 degrees, which is broil, we're going to set the clock for 35 minutes. But we're going to be checking on it because I don't want it to burn, all right? We'll be right back. After these messages, we'll be right back. Come, Come right. right. Come right. <laughs> don't do that. You take a peek. Mm -hmm. See it coming? How many minutes is that into it? Well, 20? Wasn't that much? Yeah, we fell about 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. So he's gonna turn them now? Yeah, I can turn it over a little bit. Put them over. So that takes a little bit of patience, right guys? Mm -hmm. But you have to flip them. You see the picture? Hmm? I say you see the picture. So this is another 20 minutes later or so guys. Does it take too long because it's boiling? So he turns it around so that if the fire is better on the back, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Looking good. Mm -hmm. so you're gonna flip them all again? Just more or less, yeah. Okay, he's gonna flip them all again and we're gonna let it go for a few more minutes. Let's twist this camera a second. Okay, you need to wait. Well, you're gonna have to take it this way because I want my corner. So you don't mind if you get burned. Use our mittens. <laughs> I can't move nothing because the other cameras will not catch it. <laughs> Alright, I'll move. Okay, folks, here we go, see? <laughs> hey, this camera is missing everything. This camera is missing everything for the real. Daddy! What, 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 what? The cameras are missing the things. Well, fix it, I don't know. See, this is what I have to do. You think this job is easy, huh? You just stand there and look cute and think that this job is easy. Hmm? Okay. Make sure all the cameras are seeing it. Okay, we're good. We're good. Never used to do it, but I'm tired of frying stuff in it. Yeah, frying is not good for us, so we do our little chicken nuggets for the sweet and sour chicken. We do our panadas every now and again. But 
as far as fried chicken and stuff like that and fried fish joe d does the fish fish the same way he'll put olive oil and he'll put it in the air fryer we're trying right or I put it we're in not there. perfect but we're frying we're or, trying or i put we're it in <laughs> or i do it like this yeah for the fish too as much as you can tolerate mix all it, right mix that up mix that up so mix that up we're not gonna get no wings to make honey and stuff like that no honey I'm sweet enough. Come, let's go. <laughs> I thought you were going to do it. I can't mix it up with this thing. This thing is stupid. I'll run a little one. How do you use this thing? You know what, Joe? I've been watching my van life people, right? And them people, I don't know if all of them are true. I think some of them are fake. They might live in a van just to record and then they go somewhere else and crash, right? But I think some of them are legit real. But I've noticed with these van life people, mm -hmm. they very seldom cook meat. They're not really vegans because they'll eat cheese not pizza, they they'll too eat much, eggs. Not too much of the time. To use up too much propane, right? To cook the meat. So let me ask you something. Why is it this one that I'm watching, she's always cold in her truck? You can can she not plug in like a portable heater into electricity? Yeah, I guess. Where would really they get the electricity from? From the regular battery? Mm -hmm. So maybe they don't want to kill the battery. Mm -hmm. hmm? Could be that. Because she's like, I don't want to use up my propane one. Child, I'm not sleeping in no 42 degrees. I don't even like to sleep in 72 degrees. <laughs> you want more? Yeah, a little bit more. We could tolerate a little bit more. Used to be I used to pour this whole bottle. <laughs> <laughs> so Joe got these chicken on sale, the chicken wings. Normally they're twenty-one dollars for that package at food for less. They should be calling it food for more because it's so darn expensive. But he went yesterday to pick up something else for me, and he saw this, and he's like, "It's ten dollars a package. I'm buying this," and he bought two packs. So I guess they, when they stay too long, they, they drop the price. It's manager special. He don't want to tell you guys the secret, but it's manager special. They just didn't put the name manager special on it yet. So <laughs> there's another package that the kids could probably make their own honey mustard, sweet and sour, whatever Ooh. they want to do. Do you think hot? You're going to be like Auntie Fee, burn up your mouth. Mm -hmm. You guys remember Auntie Fee? Nice and soft. These people, people probably don't even remember Auntie Fee, right, Joe? She died, right, what, 2017? Come out. Joe, what is this hot thing? You guys, we're going to eat this with what? White rice. Did you cook the white rice here? So I'm doing something. <laughs> I'm editing a video about the making of the alligator. You would already seen that video. Then we're doing this one, and then I want to make another dish with the leftover alligator. So we're trying over here, guys. We try not to waste anything. So Joe says some white rice with this. You can eat this with fries, mashed potato, garden salad, mm. whatever you want to pair this with. It's going to come out okay, all right? Now, if you like this video, go ahead and watch this one that I've listed for you. Bye bye people. You take too long to say bye bye people. I'm ending my show differently now. It's like, boom, done. Bye bye people. <laughs> <laughs> this is the Beth Angie Show.